Hello everyone, this is Jin, a TCM practitioner and instructor in Victoria, BC, Canada. Here is my online class for Pathology. This class specially for TCM students. The book we used I put below here. I help I can help the students to study and review for the class. Okay, let's start. Then we go to another illness we call asthma. So asthma is a very popular illness. Uh, still belong to chronic inflammations. Yeah, belong to chronic inflammation. But they may sometimes people got some reason and got asthma attacking. Other time, they may feel a little bit better. So we say, what happens in that? What happens in that? We still talking about the airway narrow, the airway narrow, pretty similar like chronic bronchitis. And the swollen, and the swollen, and some mucus. So they say asthma kind of patient, they may use some medication with the asthma control, but they can recurrently like happen. So when asthma attacking, yeah, asthma attacking. The key symptoms for very severe kind of discovery, or maybe with, yeah, maybe with. and uh, maybe cough, and maybe cough. So that's mainly we're talking about asthma. So asthma is a chronic inflammation uh, illness. They blocking the airway, uh, but asthma is the difference with the chronic bronchitis. Chronic bronchitis is uh, when it uh, like uh, go to some seasonal reactions, chronic uh, symptoms in there. But asthma is like a suddenly attacking. It's not especially seasonal in there. So the picture here, yeah, picture here, pretty similar like uh, chronic bronchitis. So we still say that's the normal airway, yeah, normal airway. You especially look inside, yeah, that's the air passing the root, like how big it is, the diameter there. And this one, it's an asthma kind of patient. Their bronchitis, their bronchitis. It's a, compared with normal, it's more narrow here. Certainly, it's more narrow here. That's the asthma kind of patient, like uh, not attacking, yeah, not uh, doing asthma attacking, but uh, they're still abnormal, yeah, still abnormal. So this side is asthma kind of patient, still you asthma attacking. So you compare with the second picture here. It's more narrow, it's more narrow. So you can thinking about from normal to asthma attacking, you compare there. So basically, people losing oxygen to sending all over the body. So that's why people more severe kind of difficult person. So if we try to talk about some difference between chronic bronchitis and asthma, chronic bronchitis is more cough and phlegm. Asthma is more difficult person. Even they have both symptoms like a cough, like a difficult person. But 
Ba the Mele asthma comes from people most severe kind of vehicle birth, especially when asthma attacking. Sometimes like people stop stop breathing. It's a severe kind of problem. Yeah, it's more severe compared with chronic bronchitis. Then we're talking about the water cup. Yeah, water cup. So we say asthma, the reason cause, it's not that clear. Yeah, it's not that clear. We know some people, when they're very young, they got asthma. So that kind of situation, we may be thinking about some genetic reason some kind of deficiency. And some people, when they're getting like uh, aging, yeah, or maybe over 30 or 40, something like that, then they got asthma. So that's basically a combination of environment reasons and still possible some genetic reasons kind of weakness in you. So asthma attacking, yeah. you already have some trigger, yeah. you already have some trigger, some special kind of we're talking about, allergy kind of reason can trigger asthma attacking. Like some people allergy to the flower, some people allergy to the cat. So maybe some special reason can treat asthma attacking. So we say everybody's like a trigger or maybe difference, but generally say if people got like infections, like a common cold, like a common cold, that kind of situation can trigger people got asthma attacking. And also for some people, if they do too much exercise, they may trigger asthma. So that kind of people, they couldn't do too much. Yeah. Not too much physical activity or movement. Some people asthma trigger by the cold air, like in the winter time, go outside and then suddenly got asthma attacking. And certainly we're talking about air pollution and something in the air possible triggered. Yeah, possible triggered. And even some medication, yeah, even some medication possible trigger for asthma attacking. And the emotion, yeah, stronger emotion people suddenly got a big angry can trigger asthma attacking. And the stress, yeah, people stress can trigger for asthma attacking. So that means if a patient have asthma, they will pay attention for all of the aspects here. They also trigger asthma attacking. Some people they know that, yeah they know. They will tell you. Yeah, I just uh, like a reading about the ten miller, yeah, and then as well as or maybe some other reason. Uh, so clinical symptoms about asthma. So with asthma, the key symptoms is a severe kind of a difficult thing. Oh, dyspnea, and with ulcer, yeah, ulcer. So that's the patient's only key symptoms, especially during asthma attacking. And we say during that happens, the bronchitis will be very, very narrow there. And the uh, air have to go in and the oxygen 
hard to go in, and the cable that opened it is hard to go out. So that's the Menlay symptom. Yeah, yeah, that's Menlay symptom. So during it attacking, uh, they can like uh, happens about one minute, then release, or maybe go to few hours, then release. And asthma kind of patient, usually, yeah, usually asthma asthma kind of patient, they will carry some special kind of medication, and like compare to the mouth. So usually kind of medication, like you push in here, yeah, like you push in here, and some medication coming out here. And when they are attacking, they will know that it's asthma attacking. And then they put the medication to the mouth, to the soft air. So certainly follow the breathing route, they will go to the bronchi tree. So medication have infections to dilate the bronchi tree. So we just take a small piece here. Like originally, the asthma attacking, the bronchi tube will be like this narrow, and then after medication to give, after medication to give, so the function they will dilate the bronchi. Yeah, like the air passing the root getting bigger, then people. Physical breathing can get a relief. So that generally happens. Generally happens. Uh, arthritis is a pretty hard illness. Uh, so for cure it. Because the reason we are not totally clear yet. Yeah. So that's why uh, we say we are hard to totally cure it. But truly we can control it. Yeah, truly we can control it. Like we're talking about some reason they can trigger, yeah, some reason they can trigger asthma attacking. We just try away that kind of reasons. Yeah, we try away that kind of reasons. And also, yeah, also, like we're talking about some acupuncture treatment, some herbs treatment also can help. So especially when we're talking about the asthma, uh, if people getting asthma in the pretty early age, like uh, under 10 years old. For TTM, we're always talking about that some kidney acid deficiency. So that kidney acid coming from parents. So when people getting sick or uh, illness under 10 or even some people under 6 years old, so that usually is some kidney acid disease. But I think you have heard about that, like some children get asthma when he very young, but after he grew up, never have asthma attacking. So that's we talking about after they have poor natural acids coming from our nutrition for TCM, we talking about the middle gap, three stomach function, get the nutrition. So we can build up some post natural and like all the organs development and the body getting stronger. So that kind of situation, like the people can recover. So that's basically, clinically, we need to think about like a patients, uh, if the young people or like people getting 30 aging and then got the like asthma. So if young people, usually some genetic reason in there, 
uh, audios most like the environment listen in. So we try to like we try to avoid some special kind of reason called asthma and get the people's body stronger to avoid some asthma attack. So that's we talking about asthma.